Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm gonna to film a day in the live with the S24 Ultra. Uh, today is Saturday, I have a lot of errands to run. We just moved into a new house. So I'll be taking you along with me and just kind of seeing how the S24 Ultra holds up through the day. Right now is 11.50 and the battery is about 89%. I don't know if you can see that. Let's just run some errands and see how the day goes. Okay, so we're in the car headed to, I actually need to go to FedEx right now to drop off a package, but we're in the car. I am connected to Android Auto. Um, I'm connected wirelessly. My car doesn't have wireless Android Auto, but I bought this thing off of Amazon that connects the car wirelessly. So yeah, that I feel like that takes up a lot of battery in general, but here we are. We'll see how that works. So I don't know if you can see, we're at 87%, 12.05, and yeah. Oh, my clothes are dry. Oh, and I am using this case from Pataka. They were nice enough to send this over to me, but if they didn't send it, I feel like I would have got it myself because it is really nice. It is a minimal type of case, so it's not like any type of crazy drop protection. I always have the urge to use my phone's caseless, but I am not the type of person that should use their phone caseless. So this kind of gives me like that happy medium where I can use the phone. It feels very lightweight, like it feels like it's caseless, but it adds some grippy texture in the back, which is nice. I actually did drop it. I don't know if you can see. I, I did drop it on our ceramic tile. And so the case got a little damaged, but nothing happened to my phone, which is great. So like I said, it's not the best for like drop protection, but in that case, it did protect my phone. And if you ever drop anything on ceramic tile, that's that's no joke. So I would say it did its job, so that's great. Very happy about it. Loving this case. Again, it's not sponsored. They just send it to me. But I do really, really enjoy it. Um, I'll put a link down in the description so you can take a look at their products. So as I mentioned, I had something to drop off at FedEx and here we are. So I handed that over to the guy and got my receipt and went about my way. After FedEx, we walked over to Salada for lunch since it was right next door. And for those of you who haven't been to Salada, it's basically where you can build your own salad. As you can see right here in the video, the guy right behind the counter is putting everything together for me. And it's actually been a while since I've had Salada. I almost forgot how good their salads actually are. So I'm excited I finally live closer to one, so maybe I can come a little bit more often. And there's my finished salad. So if you're looking for a fresh, healthy lunch option and you have a Salada nearby, I definitely recommend it. Then we headed over to Best Buy because I did have an order that we needed to pick up but decided just to walk around and see what they had on display. Wasn't necessarily anticipating buying anything, but... So we're at Best Buy and I was just gonna pick up something that I ordered we're just kind of browsing. Have the Ray-Ban Meta Glasses. So I think I'm gonna try to buy some. All right, secured the goods, got some. Ray-Ban headliners. That's <laughs> this is what we came for. This is what we came for. This is what we ended up leaving with. So I don't know. I've been wanting them for a while. Honestly, I didn't even know that Best Buy sold them. So when we were walking around, I was like, wait a minute. We're just gonna cop these real quick. But let's get in the car and open them up. Okay, this is what we came for. It's just a pop socket open it up okay this is a magsafe pop socket like when you would put with your iphone but the pataka cases are magsafe what okay is it not working oh there's a plastic on here i don't have my iphone with me to test it out because it should be like a regular pop socket but my other pop socket works oh there we go okay I had to find the sweet spot <laughs> okay so it should work I had some technical difficulties, but the pop socket should work with the Pataka case. You just got to find the spot and there you go and love that. And honestly, side note, I'm in Texas. I don't know why I wore a long sleeve. I am really hot right now, but nonetheless. 
So here, the Ray-Ban Meta glasses. We're going to open those up real quick. Oh, put on the AC. And I got this sun killing me. Okay. Here we go. I'm assuming I'm going to have to charge them. Okay. <laughs> Technical difficulties again. Not coming out of that case. All right. Check it out. So, so cool in my glasses. View app. Okay. So we get a little cleansing cloth. And here's the case. They were in there. And the little light. I really don't know much about them because I'm just unboxing it obviously right now for the first time. Did you hear something? Oh, battery is 61%. Could, could you hear that? I could hear it talking, but I didn't hear what it said. Okay. It said in my ears that battery is 61%. And that's all I know. That's all I know what to do with it right now. Continue our day. And uh, I will have to learn more about these glasses and probably give you all an update at another time. Because right now, I'm just going to wear them. That's where we're at. So we went to Best Buy to get our little pop socket. Ended up getting glasses. And now... Where are we going now? Going to Rocks. We're going to Rocks. People are like, what the fuck is Rocks? Rocks is <laughs> Rocks discount vitamins for some supplements. supplements. Since uh, I try to work out, I want to get some stuff. So let's head on over there. All right, so I'm recording these with my meta glasses so we can see how the video quality is. But we just left Rocks. As you can see there, got some amino chains, some basically some BCAAs. We got, my husband's going to be on some animal cuts. That's all him. And we got some capping free pre-workout because we like to work out at six o'clock in the morning. And I don't like to have caffeine within like that first 90 minutes of waking up. So we've just kind of been going to the gym on vibes cold turkey. <laughs> yeah cold turkey and then you hooked us up with some shirts which is pretty cool so that's what we got okay but it is 222 and my battery is at 63 percent been you know obviously using the camera quite a bit with like doing some videos did a few pictures nothing too crazy but that's what we're at we still have some stuff to do I think the battery will last me. Overall, the battery's been pretty good, but in the day in the lives, it's not a true representation just because you're kind of putting the phone through a lot more, oh, okay, a lot more stuff than you would if you weren't doing a day in the life. Okay, I don't really know what happened. We're gonna figure that out later. But anyway, yes, 62%, 223, that's where we're at. Just ignore everything else. Then afterwards we went to Target and I wanted to get one of these Owala water bottles for the gym. It's kind of pricey in my opinion, but I got it anyway. Then I needed some moisturizer and it does have some UV protection, so always wear your sunscreen. We didn't get too many things, so now we're checking out and headed to the next place. We're going to Ross. I have a return and maybe buy stuff for the house. I don't know. Okay, so we're finally headed home. It is 3.34. My battery's at about 54%. I don't know if you'll be able to see that, but it's at 54%. We ended up getting a couple of things at Target and Ross. Got a picture there that I'm gonna hang up. So we moved into a new home about three weeks ago. So our life has been just trying to get unpacked and settled into the new house, just kind of buying things little by little. That's why I didn't have an unboxing of the S24 Ultra. I got it when we were like in the process of signing all the paperwork for the new house and getting that situation. We sold our other home, got the new house at the same time. It was, it was crazy. So that's why we didn't have an unboxing. But I moved from the S23 Ultra to the S24 Ultra. I'm enjoying the S24 Ultra. 
you know, we have the flat screen. I think the anti-reflective coating is really neat on that. One of the cool features you're getting when you're switching or upgrading. If you have the S23 Ultra, I don't think it's necessarily worth the upgrade. You are going to get a lot of the new AI features that are coming out on the, or that are on the S24 Ultra or S24 series, I should say. I want to say they mentioned those updates coming out late March. Well, we're already in March. Today is March 2nd. So at the end of the month, I believe, if not sometime next month, um, again, I'm not 100% sure, but I think that's what I read. So if you have the S23 series, like you're going to get all that cool stuff. You know, you're just kind of missing out on the little things like the flat display, the anti-reflective coating, the 2600 nits of peak brightness. But you're only going to see that when you're outside. So outside of that, I loved my S23 Ultra. It was it was a great phone and I had the lavender color, which I ended up giving that one to my husband. So he's been using that, but he has a case on it. So you can't even see the pretty color anyway. But we are headed home it's been a long day i think so i mean for us so far just running errands uh, we've been out like what almost three and a half hours just running around we're headed home we still got a lot of day left but like look at that reflection like lack of reflection that's really cool let's see i have I think I have my S24 Plus in here somewhere. Here's the S24 Plus. Let's see, oh wow, that's a lot more reflection. I can't hold them up at the same time. S24 Ultra. S24 Plus. Okay, Ultra. I see you. Or not see you, which is part of the point. That's really cool. That's probably like one of my favorite features. I mean, you're still, when you're outside, you're still going to get some sun glare. Like, it's what, what happens with the sun. So, let me know if you got an S24 Ultra. Are you liking that anti-reflective coating on it? Or if that's a reason for you wanting to upgrade. I don't know. I guess that could be a reason for some. It wouldn't be for me. But I think it's really cool. So, let me know. Guys, we're not going to fight. Hey. We're not fighting. Stop it. No fighting. Okay, so now we're back home. I changed my shirt, still the same day, but it was just way too hot. So right now I am editing some of the footage from, I'm, I'm editing some of the footage from today, or at least just going through it. So since I edit, or since I recorded some video on the S24 Ultra, what I do is I essentially upload it to Google Photos. And so what I do is I upload it to Google Photos and then I download it from Google Photos on my computer. That's the easiest way for me personally to do it. If I didn't do that, then I would probably do something like Snapdrop in order to move things over to my MacBook. So I do edit on a MacBook. I did order a new Galaxy Book 4 Ultra. So I wanna use that to chart to see like how it does with like editing videos, but I don't get it till later this month. So let me know if you want like an unboxing or review of that. It's the, I got the 4070. So I got the Ultra 4070. I think it has like 32 gigs of RAM, but we will see what that's all about. Can you see, got my MacBook there. So let's have Google Photos up. And again, we just moved in, so if you see anything in the background, just ignore it. It's chaos right now. We don't even have like a dining room table. It's supposed to go over there, but that's for another day. Anyway, so I'm gonna do this. It is 514. And can you see our battery? What are we at? 47%. Yeah, my cat said it, it's been a long day. But yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Kind of relax, I'm a little tired. I don't think I'm gonna leave the house anymore. <laughs> We're just going to do this and then probably cook dinner in a bit too. So for dinner, we decided to make homemade pizzas. I love making homemade pizzas. We normally do it once over the weekend. And here's the final 
piece. There's mine. And then there is my husband's pizza. So we all, <laughs> we each make our own. And here we are enjoying our pizza and kind of talking about what we're going to do. Then we went outside, kind of let the dogs go to the restroom, hang out for a little bit, and enjoy this beautiful sky. There's a picture that I took. You can see low light, not the best, but now it is 8-11, 31%. We decided to watch Dumb Money. If you haven't seen it, it was actually really good. So that's going to be it for the day in the life with the S24 Ultra. If you have any questions, uh, leave them down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech-related content. But thanks for spending the day with me, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! Mm -hmm.